what makes us uh, fearful in this context are basically two things. First, you know, mind seeing change as a fearful process. Okay, that's our first, you know, first thing. You know, that's uh, making it difficult. Okay, mind seeing change uh, as a fearful uh, process, right? And the second thing is the fear of uh, losing control, right? Uh, does that sound familiar? <laughs> uh, fear of losing control, right? I think these are the roots of all the difficulties uh, in terms of dealing with uh, death and dying for us. So what shall we do? <clears throat> You know, from what I have, uh, from what I've learned, uh, and from my understanding, you know, the first thing, <clears throat> you know, the first thing that's really important to hear is uh, to work with the momentary nature, the reality that is momentary, momentary nature. Okay, when we can accept and embrace the reality of momentary nature, of living. Uh, beings, uh, when we can understand momentary nature, <clears throat> not just conceptually, but more at the heart and feelings level, right? Then we can transform the fear of death. The idea of living and the idea of dying are equally just a moment, right? Right? Both living and dying are equally happening in a moment. Right? Everything is happening in this very moment. So if we can live this moment in calm uh, mind, uh, happy mind, and if we can live every moment fully and well, you know, then uh, dying is easy. Right? <laughs> Dying will not be any different from any of these moments that we live fully, calmly, happily, you know. And if we cannot live this moment happily, uh, calmly, yeah, then the, the dying at the time of death is also quite challenging, right? Same like this moment is challenging for us, right? Same like, you know, if this moment is challenging for us, then it would be same uh, later on. So that's the first thing, momentary nature, right? Momentary nature. Uh, second thing I feel it's helpful is to work with the sense of control, uh, losing control, right? And so for that, I think it's important for us to have some sense of control of the moment, okay? Control of the moment. You know, don't think too far, don't think too big, don't think too grandiose, but just think of this moment, right? We may know some people, right, uh, who have this kind of uh, uh, problem of being a control freak. Right, uh, we may know it too well. It could be us, and so that kind of you know mindset of being a control freak is not really a healthy mind. You know, it's not healthy. Uh, it's not a happy mind. Uh, but okay, that's okay. If you like it, that's fine. You know, I, I'm not opposed to it. Uh, however, you know, the truth of the matter is, you know, having some sense of control in the present moment is a way of building your confidence, right? Your skill and your power to control the future, you know? So you can control the future in this way. <clears throat> Otherwise, there's no way 
we can control the future if we are unable to control the present, you know, this moment. Uh, you know, that's very obvious. You know, that's very obvious. And so having some sense of control of your present mind and be happy in this moment and be positive, be relaxed, be carefree <laughs> is the way to overcome this fear of death and die. Uh, momentary nature and, 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 and seizing some sense of control in this moment. Okay. <clears throat>